So ladies, this video is for you, okay? In this video, what I'm gonna do is talk to you guys about how to regain your menstrual cycle naturally. Everybody, what's going on? My name is William Grazion with Metabolic Evolution. I actually just got home from church. So go ahead and take my jacket off. And I want to give today, I want to give you guys something that I think can really be helpful. Um, I've been uh, working online now for roughly about four years, and over that time frame, I have helped a lot of women regain their menstrual cycle. So ladies, this video is for you, okay? In this video, what I'm going to do is talk to you guys about how to regain your menstrual cycle naturally without necessarily having to go to the doctor or seek any kind of medical intervention. I have had a lot of women who have come to me for this reason specifically, and a lot of women that I have helped over the years regain their cycle. So in my experience, most of the people who have come to me come to me seeking nutritional guidance, nutritional help. So in most cases, the people who I've worked with who I've helped repair their menstrual cycle naturally have came from being in a calorically restricted state which is how most women will lose their menstrual cycle. Keep in mind that the menstrual cycle is something that's very calorically expensive. So when you're, when you're limiting yourself to such low amounts of calories, things that are calorically expensive to, to create um, will start to suppress. So if you fall in this category of somebody who has lost your menstrual cycle through long duration dieting, I would first urge you before you go seek medical intervention, I would first urge you to try to recover it naturally. Um, I try to do as many things naturally as possible uh, before going to seek medical intervention. I'm not fully on board with just going and putting a lot of exogenous hormone into a young lady when that hormone naturally could have been replenished over time. Moving forward, let's go ahead and talk about how you can regain your menstrual cycle. Okay. So first and foremost, it's nutrition and mainly making sure that your body is in an optimized metabolic state. So making sure that you are in a caloric surplus. Now, the macronutrient that is responsible for your endocrine system and your hormonal profile is going to be fat intake. Now, typically when most people um, will go on a, 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 a diet, the first macronutrient that they usually cut out is either fat or carb, okay? And says people tend to think that, well, fats are bad and the fats make you fat, so I'm not going to eat fat, but that could not be further from the truth. Dietary fats serve a very important health benefit to our body, so keeping dietary fats higher is extremely important. Now, where do I recommend them be? If you are somebody who has lost your cycle for quite a long time, I mean it's been more than four or five, six, seven, eight months, we need to really try to ramp up those fats in order to get your menstrual cycle back on, back on track. Now what I recommend is starting out somewhere about like 0 .4, uh, 0 .4 grams times body weight and you can start increasing from there, okay? now. The second thing is patience and time. Okay, patience and time, extremely important in allowing your menstrual cycle to come back. Why? Typically what I notice is that it's going to take roughly four to six months, depending on how long you've, you haven't had it, in order for your metabolism and your overall health to be optimized for you to be able to get your body back to a healthy state. So time is of the essence, guys, okay? I know that it's, you know, I know it's easy to say, well, oh, I've been doing this for a few weeks and it isn't working, so I'm going to go seek medical help. Look, I'm not saying you have to do this. I'm just telling you that it's very possible because I've seen it with my own eyes. I've dealt with it with my own clients. And when it comes back naturally, I mean, they are extremely happy. So I'm just offering this 
this little tidbit of information to help those of you ladies out there who have lost your cycle. The majority of women that are probably watching this are you probably around like 120 to like 150. I'd say having your fats like 60 plus all the way up to like 80. I mean 80 grams per day. Okay, and that should put you in the best position to be able to regain your health, regain your menstrual cycle naturally without having to go to the doctor and utilize some sort of drug. I have one more tip of information. I forgot to include it in the video, but I'm following up with this here. It's regarding training and caloric expenditure. Okay, reverse dieting, increasing your fats, and all of that really it will help you to a degree, but you have to be able to help yourself in that if you are somebody who does a lot of cardio or who trains extremely intense at all times, you really need to take a step back from that, okay? I would recommend you stopping doing cardio other than maybe, you know, your your 15 minute session here or there just to keep the keep blood flowing just for your cardiovascular health. Uh, that's all I would recommend as far as cardio. If you're out there, you're somebody who's doing 45 minutes, 30 minutes, 45 minutes, an hour or more of cardio um, very regularly in the gym and you do not have your menstrual cycle and you're trying to get it back, that is not the right thing for you to be doing. Um, also in regards to training, if you are somebody who is going into the gym and you're doing just going to failure on a lot of your sets, Keep in mind how much you're taxing your central nervous system and how much you're asking of your body during a time where you're trying to ask it to recover a calorically expensive process. Okay, so really have to make sure that we're treating the body right, okay, not pushing it too hard. So you can still exercise, you can still do cardio, but not to the extreme level. Thank you guys very much for paying attention to this video. Ladies, I hope this helped you all out. If this video did help you guys, I know it's going to take a while for you to get back to me because, again, patience and time. Patience and time are what's going to show you. This does help somebody out there four, five, six months down the road, maybe even shorter than that. Please get back in touch with me and let me know that, that it helped you.